Hello everyone, so in this video, let us talk about an easy problem from lead code. The problem name is number of distinct averages. So let's start. The problem statement goes like this, that you are given a zero index integer array nums of even length. Now, as long as nums is not empty, you will repeatedly do these process. Now, the process is that find out the minimum number in nums and remove it. Find the maximum number in nums and remove it as well. Calculate out the average of the two removed numbers. The average of the two numbers are such that if A and B are the removed numbers, the average is A plus B divided by 2 and that is the example here. As you can see that it is stored in double as well, that in decimal format. You don't know the number of distinct averages calculated throughout this whole process. Now what you can see is that you have to find out the maximum and minimum element in nums. Remove that. Then find out the second maximum and second minimum, remove that. Third maximum, third minimum, remove that. So, which eventually just help me understand that I have to somewhat sort this whole array out. So, if you take this whole array, if you sort this out, it will become like this 0, 1, 3, 4, 4, and 5. Now, it's very simple that you will take the first element and the last element, find out the average of that. It turns out to be 2.5. Now you have to find out distinct averages. Whenever I see distant, one data set comes to my mind that is set. So you will just create a set and insert all these averages inside that. Whatever are repeating that will not be inserted inside the set by its own property. Now, because you'll have to find out pairs by first and last, second and second last, third and third last and so on. So you will only iterate till the half. And that's it. That's all the logic that you have to use. Let's move on to the code part. You will make a set of double because you have decimal as well here. Then what you will do is that you will first sort out all the numbers, iterate from left to right till the very middle, find out the average that is nums of i and last number, like let's say nums of uh, n minus 1 minus i, like from the very last, divided by 2. So it's 2.0 so that it will be converted to double. Then insert that particular average inside this particular set. In the end, just find out what is the size of the set. Because the size of the set tells us how many distinct elements are there that uh, are stored inside this particular set. And that's it. That's the logic for this particular code. Coming down to the time complexity, we are doing n login for this sorting. Then this is like constant time. This is inserting. So it is log inserting for every element that is for like it is n login again. So total time complexity turns out to be n login. For this particular problem now for space complexity we have made a set that will store out like o of n uh sorry so o of n by 2 you can say average values in maximum case possible which is eventually equal to o of n of e that's the overall space complexity for this particular problem as well if you still have it out you can mention in the current box of this particular problem i will see you in srd coding and bye